Hi everyone. Well, it is the last day for the ugly sweaters. It is Vlogmas day number 24. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. Oh my gosh, my viewers, my subscribers, I hope you are having a fabulous, fabulous Christmas Eve. And it's just been such a fun last few days here, just having fun with the family. And just so glad I have a few minutes to be able to stop in and chit chat with you guys. So anyway, it is Vlogmas number 24. We've had 24 days of videos in a row, 24 days of ugly Christmas sweaters and funny little hats and I'm so honored that you guys were able to share it with me it really means the world to me so I can't thank you guys enough so I'm trying to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart if you're new to my channel I hope you click on that little red subscribe button over there I would love to have you come back and join us for future videos and again we are going to be having a little giveaway at the end of all this I'll probably do something right after New Year's and it will just be for everyone to pick the ugliest sweater that I wore during vlogmas and in that video we're just going to have you tell me which day it was which was the ugliest sweater and then I will get to make a little tag for my sweater and said 2023 ugly sweater of vlogmas and whoever you know and then we'll just do a drawing from everyone that picked and uh, we'll do a little giveaway then alrighty but let's get into our vlogmas things we have got dinner cooking in the other room well it's going to be appetizer night so um Raina and her family is here her husband Jeffrey and children Quinn and Maddie Matt so we've just had a fun few days a lot of eating a lot of watching movies and just hanging out and talking having fun and tonight they are making ham and cheese sliders on the Hawaiian buns uh, and we've got some scallops that's going to be wrapped in bacon and we've got shrimp cocktail and we've got some beer batted shrimp to have for some cocktail sauce or tartar sauce and whatever anybody wants to drink whether it's soda or water coffee tea wine you name it we've got it so anyway let's get into the vlogmas things and i got some fun things to share as well Alrighty, so for the last day of vlogmas we've got our last piece of chocolate from the nutcracker advent calendar that i got from the just amazing janet so we've got this gold one here with a red ribbon these are so so good milk chocolate that just kind of melts it in your mouth the cookie of the day the shortbread cookie from waka is this star and i believe this is the only star that was in there so excited to be having this these are so so good and again they're the walker shortbread cookies from our day 24 from our glossy box and this one did have a message in it that says shine bright like a diamond and in that we've got from ritual night before christmas and it's a soy candle and it came in this little cute little jar glass house and it smells fresh it smells like maybe lavender some lemon maybe plum something fruity so this is going to be really nice maybe we will have this lit in the middle of our appetizers in a little bit the wine for my last wine from my sip and savor advent calendar is this merlot so i already pre-opened this and i didn't get to use this glass too much so i've got my drink up grinches and we'll just pour a little bit in here so anyway cheers everyone i hope wherever you are you're happy you're safe and you're healthy and if you don't have the best of health best best wishes for you to get the help that you need to feel better and just can relax 
enjoy life, and just be happy. Be kind. Cheers. Merry Christmas. Merlot you know, is so, so good. It's just nice. It's creamy. It's velvety. It's just got such a nice texture to it. Love it. Alrighty, so we've got a few things to go over. So we've got a couple of cards in the mail. This first one here, got a snowman on the back. And this was from Reviews with Sue. And snowman on the front. Tis the season to be jolly. Fa la 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 la. So December 2023, and Nancy sending warm wishes your way for the happiest of holidays. Thank you for being the wonderful person you are. Love your channel, Sue. And I'm sure everybody knows Sue. Reviews with Sue. She's about 10,000. This is the last time I checked. She was right hovering over there. So if you haven't subscribed to her yet, I hope that you do. She's got an awesome, awesome channel. Unboxings of everything that you can imagine. She is so generous. She does tons of giveaways. And she's just a really, really sweet person. So I hope you check her out. Next, we've got this card, and she's from one of our subscribers, Austin Robinson. She's from Ohio, and she sent this card. You better not pout. Really cute. And she says, Merry Christmas. As the snow gently falls and we all trim our trees, I'd like to go for a brisk walk and feel the chill breeze. I pause and reflect over my life home and friends, people like you, who give without end. I wish you such warmth, great health, and good choices. Merry Christmas, my friend, and Happy New Year's. Love, Austin. So really, really cute. Happy Jolly for Christmas. So, so sweet. Thank you so much, Austin. Thank you so much, Sue. And a little elf stopped in my mailbox and sent this awesome 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 present and this was none other than the incredible the incredible the so talented alma tyser um i'll leave her link below as well she oh my gosh she just is so creative she's so talented she i mean she just recently got into die casting and things like that and um die cutting and just uh, putting together all kinds of crafts and christmas cards and collages and so many great things. She started doing some junk journals. Guess what she made me? She is such an awesome, awesome sweet lady. I hope that you check her out. Show her some love. And you are not going to believe what she sent. Now, I saw her making this on her channel, putting it together. And she had mentioned she was putting it together for someone. And I'm thinking, she's got such a lucky friend. Not knowing that I was the lucky friend. So anyway, on the back of this, she's got this little charm here with a wine glass, a wine bottle, and a corkscrew. And I did see her putting this together. So she's got this really nice fabric. She's got it sewn here. She's got a nice binding right here. And opening it up, we've got this envelope right here and some pages. So we're going to go over some of these pages because it's, it would be selfish of me not to. She put so much work into this. And then on the back here, she's got this Merry Christmas sticker and a card that she made. Like I said, she is so crafty that she, you know, does these die cuts and she just puts all these things together. So, so creative and so sweet. So Merry Christmas. And then she's got some stickers inside and I'm sure she did that with one of her stamps. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. And it says, Hello, Nancy. I made this junk journal for you. Hope you like it. I love it. Lots of pages are blank, so you can add your own things in it. Plus, I have a head, um, a, I have a hard time with decorating them. Plus, I have a hard time decorating. Well, she did a great job decorating. And so she says, I hope you enjoy. And I am going to enjoy this. In fact, I think I'm going to put first entry in here tonight. But wait, there's more. So she did these, um, I think I'll probably just leave them in the cellophane so I don't lose them. But I've got two more of these, so one's in gold here. So again, we've got the wine bottle. We've got a wine glass, another wine glass here. 
I just found a nice little keychain in gold. And then we've got the same here. It's, well, maybe a little bit different. So this one's in silver. And we've got a wine glass. It looks like there's a cluster of grapes in here. So, you know, I have to take these out. Sometimes I struggle opening things. The struggle opening is real and unboxings. For me, anyway. But I have to show it. It's just so cute just to not show it. Alrighty. Alrighty, so we've got a wine glass right there. We've got the wine bottle, a corkscrew, and then a group of grapes. So, so pretty. So one in gold, and then this one in the silver tone. So that is so, so cute. Alrighty, so let's show you some of these pages and the hard, hard work that she's done. And like I said, she does incredible, incredible jobs. She is just so, so crafty. So on this first page, we've just got this pretty picture right here. All you need right here. And we've got that nice castle with some flowers. And it looks like, like parchment paper. And she's got more stickers in here. So plenty of room to write in here. Maybe describing the day. Maybe describing some wine that I had. Maybe add some of my own pictures. We've got this butterfly page. And we've got this one here. And there's all kinds of things inside. I love wine. And it says, Working from nine to wine. And let the good times row, flow. And again, just inside here, she's got some memos and some things like that to put in here. And a day without wine is like, I have no idea. So pretty. Again, the cat right here at the bottom and that pretty picture right here. And it doesn't matter if the glass is half empty or half full. Clearly, there is room for more wine. And then it looks like she made this little card as well. Like I said, she is multi-talented, multi and she's so, so sweet. Like I said, I saw her putting some of this together, and she was just saying it was for a friend, and it was like, oh my gosh, she's got a one lucky friend. Well, she's got a lot of lucky friends, but she makes other ones for other people as well. And I'm sure they are loving their junk journals, just like I am. Don't want to... We've got this doily in here, and again, with picture. She does, like, envelopes with stickers and things, and cards that she's made and put in there. A lot, a lot of work she put into this, and a lot of love. She, she is just an amazing sweet person. Life is too short to drink cheap wine. I think I saw another one in here that said life is too short to drink bad wine. And again, just a little pocket here with all these kind of stickers and cards in here. So, I, Alma, I can't thank you enough. This is, this is so sweet, and it's from your heart, and I'm just amazed at the work that you do, and that you made this and sent it to me. It, it really, really touches my heart. So thank you, Alma, so much. Thank you, everyone, for taking time out of your day to spend with me. You guys are amazing, just like Alma. I love you all so much. I hope everyone has a great Christmas. And uh, just uh, whether you're alone, just enjoy your time alone. Do things that you just want to do, whether you take a nice soaking bath or watch your favorite movies, or if it's nice, I'll go for a walk. Just enjoy the day. If you're with your family and friends, just enjoy them because we don't. And as our friend Jamie says, um, tomorrow is not promised. And just enjoy who you're with. Be kind to everyone. And I just love you guys so much. So anyway, without getting too mushy, I hope everyone goes out, has a fabulous day. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. Love you guys so much. And we will see you in our next video. Because tomorrow, you know what tomorrow starts? Tomorrow starts the countdown to New Year's. Love you guys. Bye-bye.
Alrighty, so we are about to sit down, and I realized I forgot to show you the ugly sweater of the day. So this one is also from Kohl's. So we got this red crew neck right here, matching sleeve, so it's red, and then it's got some gold flakes in there. We've got some ferns in here. We've got some tropical flowers. We've got a flamenco, flamingo here. It's got a colorful scarf on some bright sunglasses. He's got sequins on his hat and a pom-pom and just some Christmas lights and just some fun tropical details on the sleeve. So this is my last ugly sweater for Vlogmas 2023.